Hey there, Mike here with Cine Samples, and this is the Cinebrass Descant Horn walkthrough video. The Cinebrass Descant Horn is our expansion uh, to the Cinebrass libraries. This is a solo horn. Now, why did we decide to sample a Descant Horn? What is a Descant Horn? A, a Descant Horn is a smaller horn. It has shorter tubing. And usually what happens is if you're doing a session, a live session, uh, the first chair or first few chair uh, horn players tend to bring this instrument with them. And because what composers, especially film composers or game composers, when they're writing for horn, we tend to write really high. And there's a difference in tone between a standard French horn up here and the descant horn. So if you have some melodic lines or you want to really bring it out and have a clear tone up in this, this range, sort of above F above middle C. The descant horn has a has a just a fuller sound. So to show you kind of a comparison, let me play a little bit. Before. That's the Descan horn. Now I'm going to show you, this is uh, the Cinebrass Core horn solo. This is from Cinebrass Core. And there's no shorts in that one, by the way. It's just legato. So compare that tone to this. That's the descant horn. Here's Cinebrass core. This is a standard French horn. So it's kind of, it has like, um, it's almost like the player is um, struggling to get those notes out. Thinner. Here is the Descan horn again. It just, it sings, it, it really kind of cuts through. Um, so we have the, you know, the, the legato patch, and then I really like the shorts on this because there's two types of shorts. There's super staccato. And there's also a shorter. And then this has the new uh, legato engine that we s created for the Cinestrings solo library. So we've we've implemented that into this. You see, it kind of automatically adjusts the speed and intensity of the legato based on your performance. Right. And then the new mapping area is also in this one. So the uh, it comes with uh, the two main patches are the articulation patch and the legato patch. Again, the legato patch is just it's the same as the one that's in the articula pa articulations patch. We just separate it out, right? 
You have multiple mic positions, all the usual stuff. Okay. And then we also have um, some split patches because everything was recorded essentially in two dynamics. There's like a mezzo piano and a forte dynamic. So here is the the, the forte dynamic by itself. So um, the mod wheel, all it does is it adds a filter. And then there's the mezzo piano one. That's this one right here. And then we have the staccatos also uh, are separated out as their own patch. has the you know the the velocities are controlling the, the dynamics standard staccato and then the super short staccato is separated out as well the walkthrough a simple library desk and horn um and uh i hope you like it thanks for watching